Mr. Rosenstein, many news outlets last night and this morning are reporting that President Trump is considering firing special counsel Robert Mueller. Under the regulations governing the appointment of a special counsel, 28 CFR 600, um, and I quote, the special counsel may be disciplined or removed from office only by the personal action of the attorney general. The attorney general may remove a special counsel for misconduct, dereliction of duty, incapacity, conflict of interest, or for other good cause, including violation of departmental policies. The attorney general shall inform the special counsel in writing of the specific reason for his or her removal. Now, as I understand, Mr. Rosenstein, in this matter, you are actually the one exercising hiring and firing authority um, because Attorney General Sessions is recused. Is that correct? Yes, that's correct. And at this point, have you seen any evidence of good cause for firing of Special Counsel Mueller? No, I have not. And have you given the Special Counsel full independence from the Justice Department to conduct his investigation? Yes, Senator, and I appreciate that question. Uh, at the last hearing I attended, uh, I explained it, it would require a long time to explain exactly why uh, I'm confident that he has full independence. Uh, the short answer is, though, that that regulation, as you may know, was uh, written and implemented uh, during the Clinton administration under the authority of Attorney General Reno. Uh, I know the folks who wrote that. They wrote it to deal with these sort of situations. Uh, and I am confident that he will have sufficient independence. Uh, and it's certainly theoretically possible uh, that the Attorney General could fire him, but that's the only person who has authority to fire him. And in fact, the chain of command for the special counsel uh, is only directly to the Attorney General, or in this case, the Acting Attorney General. Uh, so nobody else in the department would have authority to do that. And you have my assurance uh, that we're going to faithfully follow that regulation, and Director Mueller is going to have a full degree of independence that he needs to conduct that investigation appropriately.